Hello and welcome to another telehealth information video. My name is Garvin and today's video is on alpha lipoic acid or ALA for short. ALA is a water and fat soluble antioxidant that's naturally made in the body. It's involved in vital functions such as energy production and protecting your cells against damage. While ALA is both made in the body as we age we produce less and less of it. We can replace this missing ALA through diet with foods that are high in ALA, such as spinach, broccoli, potatoes and liver. ALA supplements can also be used to increase levels of ALA in the body. Firstly, alpha lipoic acid is an antioxidant, meaning that it protects cells against damage. There is also some evidence showing that ALA may have benefits for individuals with type 2 diabetes. A few studies have suggested that alpha lipoic acid supplements may lower blood sugar in people with type 2 diabetes. ALA may also help reduce the symptoms of nerve damage that can be caused by diabetes. ALA has all been suggested as a potential aid in stopping or slowing the damage done by a variety of other health conditions such as HIV and liver disease. There also has been recent interest in supplemental ALA for weight loss, however more research needs to be done in this area. If you decide to take an ALA supplement, make sure to follow the manufacturer's instructions when taking it. Do not exceed the maximum recommended dose, as this may produce unwanted side effects. The effects of ALA have not been studied in pregnant or breastfeeding women, and for this reason it is suggested that you seek your doctor's advice before taking ALA if you fall into this category. ALA may interact with some medicines, so it's best to talk with your doctor or pharmacist about using it if you are taking any other medication, especially insulin or other medicines to lower blood sugar. It's possible that ALA may enhance the effects of these drugs, leading to very low blood sugar. The side effects from using ALA supplements appears to be rare and mild, such as skin rash. However, little is known about the possible effect of long-term use of ALA supplements. Stop taking ALA and call your doctor immediately if you experience low blood sugar, headache, weakness, sweating, confusion, fast heart rate, jitterness as a result of using the supplement. That brings this video to an end. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments below or contact me through lynchespharmacy.com. Thank you for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.